welcome back. Today I went to Ocean State Job Lot because I just haven't been able to find the goat milk soap at Dollar Tree. So I I got a bar a while ago at Job Lot for two dollars and then saw a video shortly after that that somebody found goat milk soap at the Dollar Tree but mine didn't have it. So I was I had to go. Plus I needed paper towels and I was amazed at the price. But I'm gonna do this in, in sections. First I'll start with the food. Wait a minute. Alright. And I noticed when I looked at all the food and you know looked at my receipt. They forgot my Junior Mints. They didn't ring them up. Or that was the item they double rang and the woman had to call the manager to... She said, oh, I, I double rang up something and maybe accidentally took the um, Junior Mints off. <laughs> so, I got free Junior Mints. But I will probably mention it next time I go in there. So I found... Kettle chips, sea salt, and oh no, vinegar. Yuck. Maybe I'll give these to my son. I don't know. I didn't read that. <laughs> I was just looking at the other kind. I probably won't like these. I'm very sad. Oh well. That was only, uh, let's see, $2.99 for a bag of chips. And it's eight ounces. Pretty good. I had to get more of my cashew halves because I went through that other one for eleven fifty. Pretty good. Those are about twenty dollars at Walmart even. And um, but they're full. I mean, it's nice to have the full ones, but once you chew it a couple times, they're halves anyway. So I couldn't find the coconut drink that I had before but I found mango no fructose corn syrup 100% daily value of vitamin C and it's a 1.5 quarts one liter for two dollars that should be yummy and of course my junior mints because I'm going to watch a movie later. <laughs> and they were free. But I'm going to pay for them. I think they were like 120 something. Maybe 129 Yeah, I'll double check. Um, mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah, they must have... That must have been what they rang up twice and then accidentally took them both off. So, and then I got food for the birds, too. I got, um, just some bird feeders to it. High energy. And it pretty much looks the same. <laughs> I just, I don't know. This one attracts wide, wider variety of birds. And the tracks, it says the same thing. So, um, those were only $139. Pretty good. So, that was the food category. Next category is household items. So, I, uh, so I got my goat milk soap. That I just love. Mmm. This is, um, da, 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 honey scent with exfoliating, ap exfoliating apricot. I think this is the kind I have, and it's, oh, it, it lathers up so good on the face cloth, and, and I, my skin has never felt softer. <laughs> I, honestly. This one is almond scent with exfoliating almond meal. And, oh, they smell good. They're great. So I'll leave that there. And my little, my grin. 
granddaughter made this. <laughs> I think I painted this side and she painted that side. We often do stuff like that. <laughs> Let's hang that out right there. Okay. Oh, and the, these you can get at the dollar store. Um, forty for a dollar twenty-five. This was thirty for um. They're reasonably priced, but let's see, um, one fifty-nine for only thirty. But hey, I guess that's not bad. And because I did that lead test on my dishes, I decided to go ahead and get some more dishes. So this is heavy-duty plastic. It was a dollar. I got a couple of these before, but I noticed one of them had like a, the plastic was all chewed up inside and it almost looked cracked. So I just got a couple more and I'll just put the one that's cracked away and, you know, just have these for ice cream. These were only, um, one twenty nine a piece. It's so colorful. Love them. And I'm just going to... I did get a plate. Plastic. You know, I got a couple fancy hard plastic, um, smaller cups in this. But, um, that was one forty nine for that. And I got a couple bowls. This is more like a peachy color. It looks yellow on the camera, but it's it looks peachy pink in real life. <laughs> and of course, this is bluish green. Well, that is more blue with a little more red tones. This has more green tones, and this is sort of in between. But that was only, these were only a dollar a piece. Um, cereal bowl, salad or cereal bowls. So I won't have to worry about the lead because I'm pretty sure that um, plastic doesn't have lead in it. So those were the household items. category is cleaning supplies and I also got this for work five dollars for a nice t-shirt with a pocket all cotton 100% cotton love it I should have got a couple more because they had all different colors so I just love cotton it's great especially when cleaning because nylon or synthetic fabric this can be sweaty. So that was five dollars. Pretty good. And I was down to the last roll of um, paper towels for work. This was only seven dollars and 99 cents for six rolls. Of shots. And that's a pretty good brand. I get excited when I find that for ten at the like CVS, but I think maybe there's eight. This was an amazing find. I got two mop heads. I've I've been bleaching them, but they're they're wearing down so much they the bleach doesn't even make them look nice. So two I got and they were each um Five seventy nine, and I get excited when I see these for six or seven dollars even. But five seventy nine, awesome price. And this was an awesome price too. Only three ninety nine, I believe. Yes, for this much. Now I've seen the smaller bottles at the hardware store for five, six dollars for 
it's much smaller. So this is 32 fluid ounces, one quart, and this will last me for a while. Uh, you know, the big ones are, are hard to carry around in the bucket because they're, you know, makes the bucket heavier. So what I'll probably do is pour some of this into my smaller container and make it easier to carry around while I'm cleaning. So that was my Ocean State job lot um, shopping expedition. <laughs> so anyway, just thought I'd share that. And um, if you're into Murphy's Oil Soap, this can be used for um, wood floors. Just you only need like a tiny little, like less than a like a teaspoonful for you know, five gallons of water, because too much will make it soapy and slippery. But I dilute this in a small squirty buck, um, uh, spritzer, um, just a teeny little bit, and about that much water to spray wood surfaces. I also use the spritzer for leather, believe it or not, and, uh, you know, vinyl because it's very mild. So, glad to find that. And thanks for joining.